And now I'm a pug? Why? Why, oh why, oh fucking why? What the fuck? I'm a fucking pug. <laughs> I am a pug. I pug, therefore I am. I got a face like a traffic accident and breath like napalm. Oh, it's great. I love myself. I'm ugly and smelly. And I love it. Yeah, people are so fucking superficial. People are idiots. I'm not an idiot. <laughs> I am a pug. <laughs> I am Mike, the pug.
De Santa. That's not the name in your file, Michael. Steve Haynes here. Yeah, Agent Douchebag. Hey, that poor son bitch we grant for you still breathing? See for yourself, right now. Trevor Phillips is on his way to help with the debrief. Warehouse, off Dutch London and Banning. Great. Sounds just like my kind of party. Taking a dump? Ah, why do you care, huh? The fuck is wrong with you? Uh, I got abandonment issues. I see a shrink once a week. You know, fuck you. Yeah, well, you know, nothing like meeting a bunch of creeps from the government in a quiet building for someone to grow balls. You see his face that last time I popped it. <laughs> Boom! Oh, ladies! God, you're an asshole. You, you back there. I know you, but you, you, I don't know. Yeah, well, until I see reason otherwise, why don't we just keep it that way? Steve, what a pleasure, bro. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> He reminds me of one of those guys you see advertising pills for middle-aged men that can't get erections. <laughs> hey, Devin Weston is a very good friend of mine, so why don't you watch your tongue? Because let me tell you something, that guy gets more tail than, uh... <laughs> than a tail catcher! <laughs> I have to fucking remember that line. <laughs> you. Mm. Where did we meet? Nowhere, pal. Yeah, we did. Hey, oh. What are we doing here, huh? This. Please, keep the sleep bastard of the way from me. No, 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 no. Ferdinand, he's gone. He's gone. Uh -huh. It's okay, I've got some new friends here now. No, this okay. is Michael. And this... This is Trevor. No. Now, our friend here... He claims he doesn't know I anything. Don't, I don't know anything. I don't know. I already told nothing. Nothing. I don't know anything. Please. Please. Sir. You know about the Azerbaijanis. Huh? Azerbaijanis. I do audiovisual, hi-fi audiovisual. It's top man, good price. VIP. You know? You're a so. fucking spy. <laughs> and the asswipes at the agency know this. No. So I need to know. What did you tell them? What did they tell you? I, I, told hmm? them, I told them what I tell you. Uh huh. What? Is, I. Hey. Whoa, 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 what is this? The house in Rockwood Hills. The man who owns it. He works at the consulate. Oh, that's all I know. That's it. That's it. That's it. I go. You're gonna make him speak. No, 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 no. You two are gonna drive up to Rockford Hills. No. And when we find out which man is the man with the problem, you put him down. No, 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 I'm tired of these fucking no, nitwits at the agency go. taking all the glory. Let me go. Hey, right, fuck is all this, huh? I think it's a good time, buddy. Who's you know, go for a drive. Wait, wait. No. You get to work, and uh, I'm not here. The guy's your neighbor. Caesar's Place, Rockford Hills. It 
the more I see of your boss, the more I like him. If I was you, I wouldn't be so critical of who others associate with. So is he gonna be a problem? For sure. But there's nothing we can do about it. If something happened to him right now, I'd be right under a microscope. An electron microscope of bureaucratic shit. And that would make it very difficult to keep old secrets. Oh, well, boo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo -hoo for you. You know who else is having trouble keeping secrets, asshole? Me. After you brought Trevor in on this. I only brought him in after you put out your press release. Townley's taking scores again. The Los Santos reboot. If we didn't control the situation and he'd unearth this connection, then what? Then Trevor flips out, beheads me, kills my family, or raises them as his own. I don't know which is worse. Anyway, any of that could happen at any time. Slow down. Let's think this through. What does he know? He knows I'm alive. He knows I got money. And now he knows I'm working with the FIB. Does he know how long you've been working with the FIB? How long? The fuck does that matter? Either you were working with us before the cash depot job, you walked your crew into an ambush, one of them spent ten years on the run, and the other landed in a federal penitentiary, or... Or, we stumbled on the cash depot job, Brad went down, you went down, Trevor got away. The FIB cut you a deal on your sickbed, faked your death, and you end up here. Who's to say which of those is true? That there's any doubt probably accounts for you being alive. Back there, Trevor made you right away. The second he saw you. Do you remember after the bust, I was in all the papers. I was on the evening news. The man who killed Michael Townley. Yeah, I was quite a trophy. A good head to hang on your wall. Back then, sure. Not now. This is bullshit. This place? Davey, they've been shooting the real cunts of suburbia here the last few weeks. No way that's your guy. Shit. You are kidding me. I'll call Steve. Wrong house. This guy isn't our guy. Okay, okay, okay. You sure you don't silence him just to make sure? If we're silencing someone, we're silencing the right someone. Get me another address. Hey, you want a coffee? Turns out that was the wrong Azerbaijani. We need a new address from Mr. K. Choose your instrument and go to work on it. Where do we start, eh, buddy? Uh, wait, what are you talking about, the wrong guy? No, who do you want? <laughs> 